Welcome back to another episode of Telework Tens. For today's episode, we're going to work on cultivating within ourselves this sense of ecstasy, for better words, um, by uh, a fun technique called bumblebee breath. And this is probably going to be a little foreign for you, and I hope you enjoy it because it's yummy. We will be touching our face, so wash your hands, pause the video, wash your hands, and come on back. So, now that we're all back together, we'll start by seating, sitting in our chair nice and upright. We have that long spine. And then we'll just start to connect to our breath, our hands maybe in our lap. Creating that separation from what we were working on before we decided to tap into today's episode. You can also do this on your back to really, really get into the zone. <laughs> but for now, this is something that you can do in your chair. And with bumblebee breath, what we'll be doing is basically like vibrating our cerebral cortex and that activates the hypothalamus and then the hypothalamus is connected to our pituitary gland and then the pituitary gland says oh we're gonna calm down now I get it I get it. we can calm down now let's be happy so that's kind of what's going on um, big picture and how we get to that point is we take our hands, our thumbs are gonna plug our ears. So don't plug them yet. I know I look like a moose right now, but I'm gonna be a bumblebee. <laughs> so we plug our ears and then we take our index finger and it's gonna come to above our eyebrows. So the index finger above the eyebrows and then the rest of our fingers cover our eyes. And so you wanna have um, activation so you'll be pressing on the side ridges of your nose as well. So again, we're gonna plug the ears, have our index fingers above the eyebrows, and then we cover our eyes, pressing into our side ridges of the nose. When we inhale, we make this snoring type sound when we do it. And then on the exhale is when we do that bumblebee, that hum, we go And then you inhale, snoring type sound. So it's getting that, that vibration and then the exhale out. So come join me, get in your zone, and then we'll circle through maybe three breaths um, together and meet me back here. And feel free to continue this as long as you need to, but I'll at least help get you, get you started. So again, long spine. <sighs> Plug the ears with our thumbs. Index finger over the eyebrows. So my senses of my ears are blocked. My vision's blocked. And I'm connected, internal, in my brain, in my body. I inhale in through the nose, snoring type sound. And then exhale with the hum. And continuing on your own.
rest in your lap, maybe palms up to the sky, invoking a sense of openness. And with your eyes still closed, just connect to this light heartedness, this open heartedness in your body. And slowly blink your eyes open. And just how do you feel now? Bumblebee breath. And this you can continue on for as long as you need and you can really get into that zone. Um, this feeling of being like flushed in the face and warm and that it's supposed to invoke some happiness and the vibrations in the brain. You did it. So awesome. Allow our left ear to drop to the left shoulder. And then up and to the right. And then to the left. And the right. And look up towards the sky. And exhale, chin to chest. Again, moving up towards the sky. Exhale, chin to chest. Inhale, back up. And then through both nostrils, breathing in. And then audibly exhale through the mouth. Inhale in through the nose. Audible exhale, ocean-like noise. One more time. The pranayama practice or this breath work is here to activate this life force of energy that we have inside us. So I know everyone here is like, just breathe, like I just need to slow down and breathe. And um, it's fun to explore different ways of breathing and how you can control it. And through your control of your breath, you're able to create the feelings that help bring up your day. So I wanna thank you for joining me for today's practice. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Namaste.